Welcome back to my channel. Today I have this beautiful set for you all, so stay tuned and I'll show you how to recreate it. First, I'll be starting with my Glitter Planet UK's gel brush. This is the number 8 synthetic hair brush and my Light Elegance Midsummer's Night. And I'm going to be applying that on my pinky and my thumb and then carrying it in my light for 30 seconds. Next, I'll be going in with Light Elegance Language of Love. I'm going to be applying this on my pointer finger and then carrying it in my light for 30 seconds. Then I'm going to go in with my Light Elegance Jimmy Gel. I'm going to be applying this on my ring finger and my middle finger. And before I cure this in my light, I'm going to go in with some loose glitters. So I'm going to be taking this fan brush and my Glitter Planet UK's Glitter, this is the Boss Chick one. Look how awesome it is, guys. Oh my God, I couldn't resist. So I'm going to be applying this on my middle finger and my ring finger, and then give it a full cure in my light for two minutes. Now I'm going to go back in with my Light Elegance Jimmy Gel and I'm just going to do a, a layer over my glitter nails. Um, you guys want to make sure that you like wipe off any excess glitters or any loose glitters that's on your nails because you don't want to get all those new loose little glitters in your Jimmy Gel or in your top coat or whatever gel that you guys are using. Um, so just make sure that you're cleaning your nail off before you go in with this step otherwise it's going to be a freaking nightmare. <laughs> And once I'm done with that, I'm going to go in with my gel bottle ink, and this is the matte top coat. I'm going to be applying this on my pointer finger and carrying it in my light for 30 seconds. Now I'm going to be going in with my stamper and my scraper and my clear jelly stamper plate, I mean stamping plate. And I'm going to use that beautiful butterfly Oh my god, it's so cute. And I'm going to go in with this pretty pink stamping polish that I don't think that they have anymore because I know that the Bundle Monster is now like manology or something. I, I have no idea what it's called, but it's called something else. So I'm going to stamp this on my nails. You guys are not going to be able to see it, but you can actually see it in person. So that's all that really matters. And then I'm going to clean off my stamping plate. And then I'm going to be going in with this next color and it's this beautiful blue stamping polish. Look how awesome that is. I just love stamping polish, especially ones that are super pigmented. So I'm going to go in with that second layer of the butterfly and I'm going to be stamping this on the nail. And I don't know if you guys noticed, but I stamped this so wrong. I mean, you can't really tell in a video, but I know in person. <laughs> that it's kind of like off a little bit and it didn't bother me I actually really liked it it looked like it had like a little halo over it so I left it and now I'm going to go in with the Bundle Monster stamping polish this straight up black and I'm going to be using this for the outline and I thought that I needed to do this off camera but I didn't I just sucked it up and did it on camera but I was trying to get it lined up right and you guys know it's it's kind of difficult filming sometimes but 
I did the job. It's okay. It's so it's all right. <laughs> so now I'm going to go back in with that matte top coat and I'm going to be applying this all over that pointer finger and then curing it in my light for 30 seconds. And then when that's done curing, I'm going to go in with my Young Nails Micro Detailer Brush and the Glitter Planet Glitter, and that's Boss Chick. And actually, I take that back, I did not cure that. And I'm going to be throwing some loose glitters into the non-cured gel, so don't cure it before you do this. And then after I'm done applying the loose glitters, then I'm going to cure it in my light for 60 seconds. And now I'm going to go in with my Enel Couture Shiny and that micro detailer brush. And I'm just going to be applying this solely on the butterfly. I want the rest of the nail to be matte, but I wanted the butterfly to be um, shiny so that all the glitters can just pop a little bit more. So that's what I'm doing here. Um, once I'm done with this, I'm going to be adding the top coat on my pinky finger and my thumb and then giving it a cure in my light for 60 seconds. These are my final results. If you guys like this video, don't forget to give me a thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel, don't forget to click that subscribe button. And as always, thank you guys so much for watching. And I'll catch you guys in my next video. Bye.